Well, the question that most people ask me all the time is what is different uh, in regression therapy as compared to conventional uh, or mainstream therapy, talk therapy. Well, the difference is, is that uh, we employ more techniques in our armament. We have more techniques than the conventional psychotherapists. Uh, and we usually utilize altered states of consciousness to locate the origin of the problem of our client. So that's the definitive difference. When you are in a light or a very deep altered state of consciousness, that you are connecting some areas of the brain, you are using a kind of coherence. And then you can evoke other memories that normally don't come now. Or you are even uh, trying to make arrangements uh, or uh, ideas that you do not have when we are in a wake state. So it's important to begin with any kind of trance. It can be a big trance, deep trance, or a very light trance. And then afterwards, we go and ask for the information that is coming. And even if it is not real, we do not care. Because for that person, in that light strength, uh, situation of trance, they, they experience it as alive, at the, as the moment, the most important. And then we deal with it. With this kind of therapy, I can go to directly to the problem. And so we can uh, look at that problem, that trauma if you want, and then we uh, change it. We change the perspective, which is therapy. That's what therapy is about, is change of perspective. And we go through the process, and normally what is supposed to be is after that, there's no problem. So I think it's more, it's a deeper process, it's more efficient, it's quicker, um, and it's the patient that um, shows the way. We give a lot of uh, importance to the patient. We, I consider him as my co-therapist, uh, and uh, uh, it's, it's another kind of uh, looking at him. We are sy symmetrical in, in this approach. And of course, then he's telling his uh, subjective reality. And his subjective reality is a reality for him at that moment. For him, it is objective. So I work with an objective reality for a subject. That is the big difference we have. And uh, the other therapists, they really keep the patient in this reality using the construction of, um, let us say, uh, cognitive uh, or dealing with the emotion but that he is taking care or explaining or um, let us say treating it in this state of consciousness and as I told you it's not the same. Therapy of any kind would be incomplete if there is no cognitive understanding of the concept because if we focus only on the mind then between the conscious and the subconscious the issues are technically with the conscious mind. The subconscious has no issues, which means cognitive understanding of the issue and the uh, therapy is very important for the client to be able to let it go. Uh, in that connection, regression therapy is an extremely powerful complementary healing technique. When people come with issues in the body and if they are very um, chronic issues, they need to have seen maybe a, a doctor before of that speciality so that they are aware that they've tried everything medically it doesn't work obviously it's coming from somewhere else but for the client to have that trust that regression therapy is my answer i think the others help us to build up on uh, what we do so the more people coming from different streams into regression therapy tells me that this is working it's powerful it, it is all-encompassing and it connects the dots for the client and we are more open to one more thing you see, the default option of uh, um, mainstream therapy accepts the genetic code, genetic uh, determination, and of course, nurture, huh? uh, environmental factors, education, socialization. 
those are important. But what we add into the picture is the soul history. We accept the existence of the soul. And we accept that as Plato, Socrates, Pythagoras before them, we accept that there is a pre-existence of the soul and it comes back and back again. So uh, we are in, uh, incorporating, let's say, the wisdom of ancient cultures as well into our therapy. Something that is a no-no for uh, mainstream therapists.